Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 3 power of x square over 9 power of x is equal to 81. To find the value of x from this equation. Now, into here in the numerator, we will write the same, which is 3 power of x square over, in the denominator, 9 power of x here. 9 is same as 3 square. Then bracket, this power of x is equal to 81. Then it will be 3 power of x square over 3 power of 2 times x is power of 2x is equal to 81. Now here division of these exponents is in the form of a power of m over a power of n which is equal to a power of m minus n. So, into here, this division, it will be 3, then we take this power minus this power, so it will be x square minus 2, x is equal to 81, 12 base of 3, 81 is same as 3 power of 4. So, when we compare, we have same base of 3, so we'll compare these powers. So, write the powers, which is x square minus 2x is equal to 4. Then, we'll take 4 to the left side, so it will be x square minus 2x. This will take to this side, it will be minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, into this quadratic equation, we'll solve this by using quadratic formula, which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. So it will be x is equal to negative b. b is coefficient of x which is negative 2. So bracket negative 2 plus or minus square root of b square. It will be negative 2 bracket square then minus 4 times a it is 1 times c is negative 4 so negative 4 bracket then over 2 times a a it is 1 so it will be x is equal to negative and negative 2 to be positive 2 plus or minus square root of negative 2 square it is positive 4 negative 4 times negative 4 it is positive 16 then over 2 times 1 it is 2 So it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus Square root of 4 times 4 plus 16 it is 20 then over 2 Then in the next step here it will be It will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 20. 20 is same as 4 times 5 then over 2. So it will be it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of we separate here so it will be square root of 4 times square root of 5 then over 2. Then it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 it is 2 times this square root of 5 then divide by 2 we'll divide by 2 in this part and here over 2 so it will be x is equal to 2 divided by 2 it is 1 plus or minus here 2 divided by 2 is 1 1 times square root of 5 it is square root of 5 therefore we have two solutions whereas the first value of x is equal to when it is positive to be 1 plus square root of 5 and the second value of x is equal to, when it is negative, it will be 1 minus square root of 5. So these are all the values of x in this our problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.